Today, I would like to ask all of you a question. Wouldn't it be nice to know that the food you're going to consume is going to make you sick or not? No, I'm not offering a time machine yet. But what I'm offering you guys is a sensor. What it is? Well, for that, consider this scenario. It's a lazy Sunday, and all you want to do is stay in bed and do nothing. Watch the Netflix show, but somewhere along the line, you feel really hungry. You walk up to your fridge, find that takeout that was maybe from Monday or Tuesday. You do not know. But nonetheless, it looks fine, smells fine, so you eat it. The evening went fine. Comes Monday, you're not feeling good anymore. No, it's not the Monday blues. You have food poisoning. Why? You're about to have jitter fevers, you are about to throw up, and you have some kind of stomach ache. So, you call your GP and say, hey, can you prescribe me antibiotics? I think I have food poisoning. She, being overly nice, says, no, you need to get a blood test first to confirm that. The result of that blood test would not come before 24 hours. If you're lucky enough, 12 hours, one way or the other, you have to wait. But what if I tell you that you can skip all of that and come right here? just before when you are trying to consume the food. You can test it with the sensor that I have developed in my PhD. How? Well, you see, bacteria like us have DNA and RNA. When they contaminate your food, they excrete substances into the surroundings, and with those substances comes out the DNA and RNA. The sensor that I have developed is sensitive to that. What it does is that captures that RNA, generates a signal, and lets you know if you can have that food within 30 minutes. So, what you can do then is you can use that, R, that sensor and can tell if the food you're going to consume is contaminated with bacteria. Because the signal can tell you if the number of bacterial cells is less than 10 or more than 10. Because if it's less than 10, you can still have that takeout. But if it's more than 10, you really need to throw that food out or order another takeout or with the help of my sensor, realize that you have to be an adult on a Sunday and cook your food unwillingly. <laughs> Thank you.